So today, I'm going to try to stay off the roads and just creep around in the alleys. I've got this big long stick and on the sidewalks it causes trouble. wheels. I'm really feeling it on these places. Hello. perfectly smooth but it's really dense. So I find the difference between Canada and the UK is we actually do have far rougher roads and that's to do with the expansion and contraction of materials from winter to summer and the road fails and the temporary nature of road works. But in the UK the very material itself is I don't know a type of porosity that makes Striding just a little bit more difficult and a little bit more tiring. I did skate some paths in a place called Aldershot where it was ridiculous, like 100 meters, and I felt like I just wanted to quit rollerblading. I just wasn't the man I used to be. I was jet lagged or something. But no, it was a material. So that's why I'm able to seek out the rough here. I'm usually quite fresh because I have been skating on some density. taken that with more balls but if I miss it it would be some skin off my back to rest or not to rest that is not a question This is wasteland at one time. I don't know what's going on. It's pretty nice skating surface. Ooh. That's pretty uh, grippy. Maybe it's just new to me. The uh, paint is cracked. Is it dangerous? No, they're bad. Like this. Boom, and let's pop in. Oh, that's crazy. Maybe I'll hit that as a jump. That could be done. I like it. I think I know a few other skaters who will also like it. Oh, finally. Oh, Toronto. Whenever you want to take a dump, you can count on you're in luck. Taking a dump in the most beautiful of cities, the most beautiful of places. Take your dump with your in luck. There we are, city edge. Yeah, you betcha.
I haven't caught two lights in a row yet. Okay. We're just trying to stay off the roads and just creep around in the alleys. Who knew there was one-handed pedal technique? Not I. Finger paddles. Finger paddle? That might be the way to go. Or the, the, the hand stomp. Oh, it was definitely more of a hand stomp than a paddle. It was the only thing keeping me from getting my white shirt dirty. I think that's what I was thinking about there. Without well, how embarrassing. I don't know if I can go as slow as a bicycle. This is how bicycles go. Bring her to the stop. Woo! <laughs> I actually pinged that truck. Kind of felt nice. Oh, there it is. I almost missed it. get further hydrated. I dehydrated way before the session here. I always try to remember that what I drink beforehand makes a difference in everything after. That's awesome, John. What's Chico. Chico. Hi, Chico. Yeah, there's your oh, my friend. Now go home, grab the 5D and stalk the city like a crazy person, but in shoes. See, being slow can be fun. We have a stretch of an interrupted pavement. That's how I feel about that. 
So I've just been skating and I had a great time. I always feel a million times better once I've been skating. At the beginning of that skate, I was feeling anxious and nervous. And at the end, it was like the exact opposite. I don't know what I would do if I didn't have skating or working out. Um, even going out and shooting videography here on Queen Street, I can operate with a little anxiety or I can have this plan of things I want to get and run around like I'm in a hurry when I don't need to be getting all sweaty and greasy and not really enjoying the process. But today I'm on the Demerol of exercise, so yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs>